Every conflict eventually boils down to numbers. The number of troops, the number of battalions, artillery, armored vehicles, defense spending, all of it. All of it decides the outcome in a war. This gives us a sense of what to expect from a conflict, which, which side the odds are stacked against, and which side they're tilted in. So if we look at the Russia-Ukraine conflict in terms of numbers, how do the both sides compare? If a war breaks out, is it going to be a fair battle? Our next report has some numbers and answers. Russia and Ukraine are the two largest countries in Europe. The neighbors were once part of the 15 Soviet republics, which made up the USSR. In 1991, following the collapse of the Soviet Union, Ukraine became an independent nation and distanced itself from Russia. Since then, it has grown into a potent military force, with the second largest military in the region and second only to the Russian armed forces. But how capable are Ukraine's armed forces to tackle Russia in case of an invasion? Here's a head-to-head -head comparison. According to the 2022 Global Firepower Index, Russia has a military spending of $61.7 billion. That's 11.4% of its total government spending. In comparison, Ukraine was spending $5.9 billion on its armed forces, which equals to 8.8% of the Ukrainian government's entire spending. If we speak of military manpower, Russia has 900,000 active personnel. Ukraine has 209,000. Russia has 2 million reserve personnel. Ukraine has 900,000. If we speak of artillery or heavy military range weapons, Russia has 7,571. Ukraine has only 2,040. Next, we have armored vehicles, which combine operational mobility with offensive and defensive capabilities. Russia has 30,122 armored vehicles. Ukraine has 12,303. When it comes to tanks, the primary offensive weapon of any army, Russia once again has the edge. It has over 12,420 tanks, compared to 2,596 tanks in Ukraine's arsenal. When it comes to attack helicopters, Russia has 544 of them. Ukraine has just 34. And lastly, if we speak of fighter aircraft, the most potent weapon in air-to-air -air combat, Russia again outranks Ukraine. It has over 1,500 fighter aircraft. Ukraine has just 98. Russia outweighs Ukraine in almost every aspect. This may give an impression of an impending Ukrainian defeat in case of a war. But that may not exactly be the case. A number of countries are arming Ukraine to prevent the conflict from spilling over. This includes Estonia, which has sent Javelin anti-tank missiles to Ukraine. Latvia and Lithuania, who've sent Stinger anti-aircraft missiles to Ukraine. The UK, which has sent 2,000 anti-tank weapons. And the United States, which is deploying 300,000 troops in Eastern Europe to bolster Ukraine. To put it simply, in case of a war, Ukraine may not be as vulnerable as the numbers indicate. Bureau Report, Vion, World is One. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.